what is up what is good all of my wonderful amazing kings and queens brothers and sisters welcome back to the mommy in the world's channel welcome to if you're new and everybody welcome to what we're watching wednesday with your girl the hostess with the mostest tyler renee let's get So, as some of you may or may not know, your girl is always down for a good story, whether it's in book, audio, or film, television show, series form. And I will be letting you in on what the Royalty Book Club will be reading um, for the foreseeable future. But as of right now, we're going to talk about television, okay? If you are new to the channel, I am Tyler Renee, your host with the most she, her, they or my pronouns, and I watch just about everything. Um, before life took a turn, we were doing the 100 reviews. We are currently on episode 5 of the 100, and I will be picking that back up if you are not aware of what the 100 is. It is a dystopian future um, set a couple hundred years from now. Currently on Netflix, it was on the CW. But Netflix picked it up because it was great. It has seven seasons. It is about a um, hundred teenagers, all juvenile delinquents, being sent down to Earth after a massive nuclear, um, after a massive nuclear war, shut that thing down over a hundred years ago. So check it out. Currently on Netflix, the one hundred. And if you're not aware, the Dear Mama, the two. The Tupac documentary has come out on Hulu, and I have been watching and eating that ish up. I believe I have the last episode to finish, and I will be ready to discuss parts one through four with you all. And if you're not aware of what Dear Mama is, the Tupac doc documentary, it is about Tupac's life, his mother, his family, how he's grown, and so forth and so on. It is currently available on Hulu, and as of right now, it is everything. Whoever created that show, I will be having, of course, more information on that when we get into a formal what what we're watching Wednesday. We're just discussing one individual show and topic, but it is great. If you are not watching it, it is available on Hulu. Dear Mama, the Tupac documentary. Also, on Netflix, Queen Charlotte, The Bridgerton Story. Just watched the first episode. I already know it's going to have me enters in a mess by the end because I am a sucker for what is true love, soulmates, and once-in-a-lifetime thing that you can get nowhere else but with that one person. And I see that. I saw that in the Bridgerton series with Queen Charlotte and King George. And I know it's going to break my heart in their own personal series. But if you're not aware, Queen Charlotte, A Bridgerton Story, is a spinoff of Bridgerton, which features the queen from Bridgerton, Queen Charlotte, of Queen Charlotte, of Queen Charlotte and King George, uh, the uncle and aunt of Queen Victoria of the United Kingdom. They were the king and queen of Great Britain. And their story unfolds and leads to the king's madness and the deterioration of, I'm guessing, their love story, which is going to break my heart. But I am down for the pain. I have backed up off of Grey's Anatomy, so I could definitely, I could definitely use a good cry right now. Um, and last but not least, I am here to see what the fluff and the stuff and the hype is about. When it comes to good old Snowfall, Snowfall on FX. Everybody has been talking about it. And yeah, no, I don't watch stuff, but everybody else is watching stuff. Because then, y'all be spoiling the next episode for me. I'm not even there. So, I wait until the series is over to see if I like it or not. But I did watch Snowfall when it first came out. Like, an episode or two, and I was really feeling it. But, the way y'all talking about it on social media got your girl interested all over again. So, I will be seeing if the hype is real or the hype is just a feel-good black shit. Other than that, I do have a few announcements. You can be... 
I will be here for a what you're watching Wednesday, every other Wednesday. So the Wednesday after this one, we'll be discussing. I will be putting up a poll on my community tab, Facebook and Instagram. Hello, son. Facebook and Instagram, where I will be, uh, where we will be voting on what we'll be watching first and discussing first. So stay tuned for that. Be sure to vote. Also, be on the lookout for that life update. Things are happening. Things are happening, and things are happening. And I really wish I could talk to somebody about them. And I think it's time to let you guys in on life. Also, as I said before, I will be releasing the TBR, the To Be Red list for the Royal Tibble Club and all others that wish to join us this month and in the future. So stay tuned for that this week. And I believe that will be all. Oh, also, the new, that Royal Tibble Club newsletter will be going out this Sunday night. So stay tuned for that. If you are not on our newsletter, um, if you're not signed up for our royalty newsletter, be sure to do so. The link to the newsletter, the link to the Royalty Book Club Instagram, and the link to the poll, hopefully, will be down in the description box below. Be sure to comment. Let me know what you've been watching, what you guys think of all of these shows. Um, if you have watched or are watching them, please do not drop any spoilers in the comment section because I will not have it. I'm a little old YouTube channel, family channel. Say hello, son. Hello. Please. And we do not have mods, so I will cuss your ass out and leave you in the comments. Mm. Thank you all so much for watching this video. We truly appreciate it. And the queen and the prince, oh, and the don are out. Peace, love, and positive mm. vibes, y'all. Deuces. Uh, Nino, I'm just gonna tell the truth. Uh. Damn, tell me, baby, what is love? I could fuck, but baby girl, to make love. Man, I experience too much fake love. Really, though, I'm playing double dutch between hate love to some love and now to some love.